I'm not looking forward to this day, but I'm going to go ahead and do it anyway. And by it, I mean putting myself on this thing. I haven't gotten myself on a scale in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, in July, August, September, uh, several months. Now, here's a little advice. The first time you weigh yourself, do it with your shoes on. That kind of gives you a running head start of a couple of pounds in the next week. By the way, don't tell my wife that I'm doing this on the sofa. Yeah, speaking of telling, somebody reported me to the video police last week that I was dealing in hate speech because I made fun of Nancy Pelosi. Oh, come on. Hi, Nancy. How are you? You wild 60s radical liberal hippie San Francisco chick. Let's party! I mean, come on. Make fun of Nancy Pelosi? There's more vacuum in that head than in a Kirby vacuum factory. There I go again. Back to the weight thing. It's been a real struggle the last few years trying to keep the weight off. So with that in mind, I'm going to throw the scale down on the floor and I'm going to see what the numbers say. And the beauty of this thing is it uh, supposedly has some positive reinforcement built into it. It does a little talking. So we'll see. One at a time. Please. It's just me. We are both in trouble. Hey, yeah, you don't know trouble. Dump some blubber, Buffalo Boy. Buffalo Boy? Beautiful. Of all the scales, in all the Walmarts, in all the world, I had to make Psycho Scale mine. The moment of truth is here. 249. <gasps> Fat man. Oinky. 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 I'm crying behind this dollar store version of Foster Grants. I gotta go see if there's some M&Ms in the house to take my mind off this depressing state of affairs. And don't complain to the video police that I'm making hate speech against M&Ms, okay?